Hello everyone, Sam Classic here, and today I'm going to do a video about my Casio SA75 portable keyboard. So, this keyboard I knew about for a very long time now, and Casio has made many of these keyboards using different instruments, well using the same instrument library. And they changed up some of the set models of the same keyboard come with different like patterns. Um, but this one is very good because it has a light indicator. You see that little little thing there? Well, that's your battery indicator. So it t tells you how much battery you got left. I, I kind of like that feature. But there's also another cue to tell you how much battery you have left, and that is a sound cue. So as you're playing the keyboard, if you hear little bits of crackle while you're playing like on a piano sound, if it's like getting louder, and that means the batteries are running down, but I just put the batteries in here so it sounds very clear. Now this keyboard has 100 voices, and well it's called tones, 100 tones, and it has a power supply so you can plug it into a power socket and you can plug in headphones and speakers. Now the battery door is located right here and you just slide it open and the batteries come out of there. And you... Now I do have another portable keyboard, the Yamaha PSS 14 and 15. Well, I did have the 14, but I just got one of them now. I got the 15. But the Yamaha PS says 15. For some reason, my Duracell batteries don't seem to want to sit in the, um, against the springs anymore. I find, a, I find that a bit of a shame. But, um, I can get some Energizer batteries that will fit in there. I think, I think they're a bit, um, thick now between the spring. So I need to have some Energizer batteries for that keyboard. And I'll power it using those. So, let me turn the keyboard on. And it has a very nice um, piano sound for a toy keyboard. And this is what the piano sound sounds like. Yeah, so that, that has a very nice clear piano sound and when you play two to four notes together it is all calibrated so this is all cal nicely calibrated Now, let me show you another sound. I like the organ, the sound 8, the street organ. You can really hear the crackle through that instrument. Like when you play like two notes, you get a, a crackle. Yeah, that's a normal crackle. But then when you turn it down one volume, you can hear it on another volume. But yeah, I've got fresh batteries in here, so it's not going to be fully um, distorted just yet. And I can get it really distorted, like it will appear on, when you press in the first, like, one key, you can hear it there. Um, okay, I'll sh quickly show you some patterns on this keyboard. Um, so you've got, uh, like, it's eight beats, number one. That's like your bop it beat. And then you got a uh, 16 beat. 
I think they use this one for the demo song Ode to Joy. And then you got a pop beat. Now I'm gonna try and play the Old World Adventures 2 melody on here. Now I'm gonna try and find the best beat to go along with the melody. So let's see what I can do. Let's try this one. Nope. Yeah. Um, which one would be good for Oddworld Adventures? Um, let's see, what about rock? Oh, I mean pop. speed it up now. Another sound that you, you can really hear the, the vibration, and that sound for first is six. <laughs> it sounds like it's really like crunching, like. very quickly you can hear it going taking off in the background like yeah you can hear it taking off in the background oh it's taking off in the background Okay, and you got the ambulance. Insect. Emergency alarm! And then, uh, so on that one, you got a mixture of emergency alarm and a car steering. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
The laser beam! Typing to my freelancer. <laughs> there you go. So yeah, that was a review of the Yamaha. Not yeah, sorry, the Casio S A seven five. Very nice keyboard. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned as I'll have some news to show you about Oddworld Twice C Flavor, my 20th anniversary aid game, and I'll have some character models and animations to show you. So my freelance developer, me and Aldi, we're taking a break from the game and we're working on my studio website, Fantastic Game Studios, and then after that we're going to be continuing on the game but first i need to get all my models up together so we're gonna do i'm gonna do that and then we'll have um well me and zoo will be working on my studio website so yeah thank you for watching and i'm out of here <laughs>